Namaste. Thank you for joining Yoga with Eva for today's class. And today we will be practicing more for your back, for letting go the tension from the back, the yoga poses and asanas to be focused to this uh, aspect. And of course, we will start our class like all the time with a little bit of meditation and a breathing technique to clear your mind. Then let's find yourself a comfortable position to sit. You can be cross legs or sitting on your heels or sitting nearby the wall, whatever feels good to you. Just try to remember to keep your back straight. Close your eyes, place the palms on your knees facing up. And have a deep inhalation to your nose. Then slowly and completely exhale to the nose. You breathe in and out. Feel how the breathing helping you to become more and more present. With each breath, you're becoming here and now. Breathe deep and slow to the nose and feel how they are coming in and out. Using your breathing to connect deeper to your own body. Feel how your body is this morning. And use your breathing to connect people, to understand your own body and to let go the tension from the body. And see if your mind using the breath to calm the mind, to empty the mind. to let go all the words and thoughts from the mind. Inhale calmness, exhale let go. If you find it difficult to let go the thoughts and words from the mind, it's okay. Just keep your all focus to your breathing. Breathe deep and slowly. And feel how you're connecting your body, your mind and soul to one. Connecting deeper to yourself, to the real you. Just stay in this present moment and breathe. start our practice with a gratitude. Think what you are truly thankful this morning. There are so many things to be thankful, situations, people. Find yourself five things that you are grateful today. three more small things in the life that sometimes we forget to be thankful. Fulfill yourself with this gratitude energy. A deep inhalation, placing the palms together to Namaste in front of the heart center, slightly bending the neck, get ready for today's practice, giving yourself some intentions for today's class. Mm -hmm. 
And if your eyes close, your other palms together. Nothing slow, you're feeling your own energy. And I'm spreading it all over you, placing the palms under your eyes, placing the palms on your head, your neck, shoulders, your arms, chest, waist, until your toes all over your body. And then slowly opening the eyes with a big, big smile. Namaste. I hope you feel a little bit more grounded now after short meditation to balance and harm on yourself. And you keep moving now to the uh, breathing technique to work a little bit more with the mind. Because mind is not so easy to get uh, empty or free from the thoughts while we using the breathing technique. And today we will try the counting home and we inhale counting until four, we hold the counting until four and then exhale and counting again until four. This is one round. We'll try three rounds uh, until four and then two more rounds until five. If you feel until counting until four or five is too much for you, it's okay, start with number three or two, whatever feels good to you, okay? It's also good for your lungs to get more oxygen and um, for your mind to clean, to clear everything from there because we are so focused on numbers and inhaling, holding and exhalation that there is no time actually for really thinking what's happening, okay? Let's uh, keep your back still straight for the breathing and if you need to change the pose keep no sit in the same position and then close your eyes and keep your palms facing up have a few deep breaths inhale and exhale inhale and exhale Keep your breathing deep and slow through the nose and try to notice for the moment what's, what's going on in your mind. And whatever is there, it's okay, no judgment. Just let it be. Focus your breathing. And we start our first round. Inhale, one, two, three, four. We hold, one, two, three, four. Exhale, one, two, three, four. Inhale, one, two, three, four. We hold, one, two, three, four. Exhale, one, two, three, four, inhale, one, two, three, four, we hold, one, two, three, four, exhale, one, two, three, four, inhale, one, two, three, four, five, we hold, one, two, three, four, five, Exhale, one, two, three, four, five. Inhale, one, two, three, four, five. Behold, one, two, three, four, five. Exhale, one, two, three, four, five. And come back to your breathing through the nose, deep and slowly. Try to inhale as much as you can and exhale as much as you can. And again, bring your attention to your mind. Try to notice how is your mind doing now. Maybe you feel more clearness and calmness in your mind. Maybe it's more empty now. If no, it's okay. Try to use your breathing to connect deeper to your own mind.
and then slowly open your eyes. After practicing a little bit of meditation and working with your mind, let's move and connect with your body. But try to keep the connection, the breathing, your mind and your body together. When we move, we feel and being aware of your breath, feeling aware of your mind, the thoughts coming, and also of your emotions. It's not just exercise, it's being mindful when you do the practice. And today, because we're focusing more to your back and trying to let go the tension or pain from your back, to strengthen your back, try to remember and every time you move, try to notice how is your back feeling in different positions. Okay, we will be uh, keep sitting if you need to change the pose. All the time, remember it's okay to change the pose. You don't need to sit all the time in the same position. And we try to keep your back straight. Why? You have to sit comfortably. If it's nearby the wall, it's okay. If it's sitting on the heels, it's okay. Even if you sit in the chair, it's okay. Try to keep the back straight. Okay, and uh, first of all, we're now focusing to your neck. Because the spine starts in your neck. Okay, inhaling in the center. And we exhale, placing the left palm on the right side of your head. And exhale, slowly moving to the left side and feel the right side of your neck. Inhale. Exhale, if we can, we move a little bit more to the right. Inhale and exhale. Breathe in, slowly coming back to the center, letting go the left arm, the change. Inhale, exhale, and slowly moving to the right side, feeling the left side of your neck. Inhale and Exhale. One more deep inhalation and exhalation. And slow inhalation coming back to the center. Okay, let's go all around and let go of the tension from your neck. Inhale and exhale. Notice how is your neck today? Moving to the other side. Inhale and exhale. In and out, and slowly come back to the center, feeling the breathing and movement going together. Let's try to feel this movement and breathing using the hands. Okay, inhaling, lifting the arms up, placing the palms together, lifting all the body up, stretching the body. Exhale, and slowly going down. Inhale, lift the arms up, placing the palms together, stretching up, up. Exhale, going down. Inhale. Exhale. One more time. Inhale. And exhale. We breathe in now. Lifting the arms up, stretching up, feeling your spine, feeling your back. Okay, then lifting the arms up and then bending, hugging your elbows. Okay, hug, feel comfortable. And lifting the arms up. Keep it behind your head. Stay there for a few breaths, feeling the spine. Inhale. And exhale. Feel how you're lengthening your spine up. Inhale. Exhale. And feel your arms also. We breathe in deeply. And we breathe out, moving to the right. Inhale, coming back to the center. Exhale to the left. Inhale. And exhale. We breathe in. And out. Inhale, coming back to the center, lifting the arms up, and then slowly letting go. From here, let's move to the twisting pose. 
which is really good for your back to release all the tension you're placing the left arm on the right knee, the right going behind. Inhale in the center. Exhale and start slowly moving and twisting to the right. Just stay there for a few breaths. Inhale and exhale. Feel the twist in the spine. If there is tension in the neck, looking forward. Inhaling deeply. Exhaling slowly, coming back and change the right palm on the left knee, the left behind. Inhale. Exhale. Slowly moving and looking to the left. Inhale. And exhale. One more deep inhalation. And exhaling slowly, coming back to the center. Okay, from here, let's move to the table pose. In table pose, remember the palms under the shoulders, palms fully on the mat, in the, keeping the fingers widely. Then keeping your uh, knees under your hips. And this neutral pose, you also can, can come on your toes to get more stable. Now you can keep the feet on the mat. Okay, and now we'll be moving to the puppy pose, which is really good for your back to relax and let go the tension. Okay, you're moving a little bit in front with the palms. Inhaling, looking forward. Exhaling, slowly moving backwards. It's very similar to child pose, just not sitting on the heels and then placing the head on the mat. And we stay there for a few breaths. Inhale. And exhale. Feel how the tension is leaving from your back. Inhale. And exhale. One more deep inhalation. Exhale and coming back to the table pose. And from here, we're moving to down facing dog. Okay, coming on your toes, lifting the body up from the hips, head is down between the arms, and let's stay there. Breathe. Inhale and exhale. Feel you're lifting the body up from the hips. If you can, and you're not too much tension for your legs, try to go down from the heels. If it's too much tension, bending the legs. Inhale and exhale. Okay, one more deep inhalation. And exhale now, trying to twist the down facing dog with the left, uh, with the right palm, trying to touch your left ankle and looking forward. Inhale and exhale, slowly coming back. Inhaling, moving to the other side with the left palm, moving near the right ankle. Inhale, exhale, and coming back. Stay there for a few more breaths. Inhale and exhale. We breathe in, slowly coming back to the table pose. And from here, we're moving to the child's pose to rest. Your feet, your toes together, heels going to the sides, be sitting on the heels, and then slowly going down the head on the mat, arms in front, stretching the arms. Feel your back, your spine, just breathe the inhale and exhale. Letting go the tension from your back, relaxing. And then slowly coming back to the table pose. To relax your back more. We perform the cat cow pose, which is really good for your spine to release all the tension. Just make sure the arms under the shoulders. And with inhalation, we arch in the back and looking up. Exhaling, we're rounding your back, your head is going down. Inhaling, we arch, looking up. 
exhaling the round. Inhaling and exhaling. Try to notice how is your spine feels through the movement. A few more times. Inhale and exhale. Okay, and from here moving more to twisting to the thread needle pose. Inhaling, lifting the right arm up, looking up. Exhale, going with the right arm behind the left, placing the palm on the mat, head on the mat. Okay, and inhale if you're okay, lifting your left arm up, looking up. Staying there for a few breaths. If it's too much tension, place the left palm on the lower back. And try to look up or looking forward. Inhale and exhale. Feel the twist in the spine. Notice how is your back. Inhaling deeply. Exhaling slowly going down and coming back to the table pose. Moving to the left side. Inhale and lifting the left arm up. Exhale and going behind the right. Head on the mat, inhale, lifting your right arm up and staying there, breathe, inhale and exhale. One more deep inhalation, exhale, slowly coming back and coming to the table pause. Okay, from here we're moving to the half lunge pose. First, we'll move to the right side, then the second with the left. Bringing the right foot between the palms, the palms and your right foot in the same line. You can come on your left toes to get more stability. And inhale, lifting the arms up, staying in the half lounge pose. Just make sure your leg is bent at 90 degrees, not more, but not less. This is the best uh, position for your knee. Inhale and exhale. We breathe in and out. One more deep inhalation. Exhaling slowly, going down with the arms, bringing back or center with the fingers, opening the chest, looking forward. Breathe there. Inhale. And exhale. If we can, lifting a little bit more your arms up, feeling your chest, your spine. Inhale and exhale, letting go of the arms, bringing back here by your right foot. And we're moving to the full lounge pose. Inhaling, lifting the left leg up, the leg still bending to the right one, 90 degrees. Inhaling. And raising the arms up and stay there. Feel your legs, your arms, inhale. Exhale, slowly going down the arms and develop the fingers, opening the chest. Inhale and exhale. We breathe in. Now, when we breathe out, slowly bending forward, lifting the arms up. Inhale. And exhale. You breathe in, lifting up, letting go of the arms, and coming fully on your feet. Then the right foot looking to the right, and the left is a little bit inside. If you're bringing the hips and the chest looking forward, we're moving now to the warrior two pose. From there, we'll be going to the chine. Inhale, lifting the arms up, feel it in the same level with the shoulders. Here, just your head moving in the warrior two. Hips, chest, arms, everything in the same position. Okay, inhale, move, looking to the right, exhale, bend. Again, trying to bend 90 degrees. Looking to the right side, just feel hips, chest, Looking forward, inhaling, 
and exhale. One more deep inhalation. And now when we exhale, start moving to the right and slowly start going down, lifting your left arm up, looking up if you can, stretch your right leg and stay there in the half and stay there in the triangle pose. Okay, if it's too much tension for your neck, looking forward, feeling also the left hip. Maybe you need to move it backwards, stay with the shoulder. Inhaling, exhaling slowly, bringing the palms near by your right foot and going to the pyramid pose. Inhaling, lifting the torso, looking forward. Exhaling, inhaling, lifting the torso, looking forward. Exhaling, bending the right leg, left knee on the mat, palms near by your foot, inhaling, looking forward, and then exhaling, moving back with the leg, coming back to the table pose. And let's move the same flow just with the left side, bringing the left foot between the palms, coming on the right toes, just get stability, and going to the half lounge pose. Inhale, raise my arms up, make sure about your leg. Stay there for a few breaths. Inhale and exhale. You breathe in and out, slowly going down with the arms, bringing backwards into the fingers, opening the chest. Inhale and exhale. You breathe in. And out, letting go, bring the palms near by your foot, inhale and lifting the right leg up, going to the full lounge pose, inhale, raising the arms up, make sure it's 90 degrees, inhale, and exhale, breathe in, and out, going down, and through the fingers, stretching, opening the chest, inhale, and exhaling slowly bending going down lifting your arms up inhale and exhale breathe in lifting up letting go the arms and coming back on your feet okay then just let me change the other side make sure the left looking to the left the right inside hips chest looking forward inhale raising arms up same level with the shoulders just your head moving to the left side inhale exhale bending the leg mind degrees looking there feeling the hip in the chest breathe inhale and exhale we breathe in and we breathe out, moving to the left as much as we can and slowly going down, lifting the right arm up. And if you can, stretching the legs, staying in the triangle pose. Inhaling and exhaling, feeling the hip, feeling the chest. Inhale, and exhale, slowly bring the palms in the your left foot. Inhale and lifting the torso up. Exhale, bend, inhale, exhale, bending the left leg, right knee on the mat, palms in the bottom left foot, inhale, and lifting forward, and exhale, coming back to the ankle pose. From here, I'm going to do a child pose to have a rest. Feet together, toes together, heels to the side, and going down, stand there, breathe. Then with inhalation, slowly coming back to the sitting position and we're moving to the standing. Okay, placing the palms on the mat, lifting up with the toes. And first of all, let's see for the moment how do we use, bring the chin 
to the knees, you can support yourself with the palms. And stay there for the moment, feel your back. Feel there is no tension. Okay, coming forward and your feet start lifting the body up. Inhaling with the arms, lifting the body. And arch backwards. And then slowly letting go and coming back to the standing position. In the standing position, we're coming to the mountain pose. Your feet together, feel your whole body strong. Legs strong, the pecking tailbone, opening the chest, the arms strong. Start focusing. And close your eyes, have a few deep breaths. Feel the back, feel the spine, feel all the body. Imagine your body is like a mountain, strong and stable. Now we breathe in, lifting the arms up and to the fingers, stretching up, coming on your toes, stretching even more and more up. Stay there for a few breaths, inhale. And exhale slowly, letting go. Let's move with the bending. Notice how the back feels here. Stand a little bit apart. Okay, inhale and lifting the arms up. Then we exhale and start bending your legs slowly. Moving forward, bringing the fingers nearby your feet and lifting the arms up. Inhale. Exhale, going down with the arms. Fingers nearby your feet. Inhale and lifting up. Inhale, and exhale, and slowly going down. Inhale, and lifting the arms up one more time. Inhale, and exhale. We breathe in and out. And stay there for a few breaths. Inhale. Exhale, and you can interlock the fingers, stretching a little bit more your arms up. Inhale, and exhale. If you even can, try to feel. Maybe you can stretch the legs up. Inhale, and exhale. Feel it go the arms and slowly going down. Inhale, and lifting up. And let's go. Let's move to the chair pose, which is also really good for your back and also for your core. Okay? We stay a little bit apart, feeling full on your feet, grounded. Inhaling, opening the chest. And here is an important part when we go into the chair pose, like inhaling, looking forward, exhaling, we start bending and reaching the core, slowly going down. We try not to arch the back, okay? Because then more tension coming to the lower back. You try to keep the spine straight, you tuck in your tailbone. Okay, let's try. Inhale, open the chest. Exhale, and start going down, gauging the core. And not the most important to go so down. Try to feel your back is not arching, tuck in the tailbone. Open the chest, stay there for a few breaths. Inhale and exhale. Breathe in, raising the arms up, staying there. Inhale and exhale. You breathe in, and if your body allows, maybe you can go a little bit more down, but try not to arch your back. Like not moving too much forward. Okay, inhale. Exhale, one more deep inhalation. Exhaling slowly, letting go, coming back. And now we can move to the twisting chair pose, which is really good for your back. Inhale and open the chest. Exhale, we start slowly bending, engaging the core. Inhale, palms together. Exhale, moving with them. Left elbow on the right leg, looking to the right side. Try to keep the elbows in one line. Inhale and exhale. 
You breathe in, when you breathe out slowly, going down, you can sit a little bit more. Inhaling, exhaling slowly, coming back to the center, and lifting up, letting go, moving to the left side, and tail opening the chest. Exhale, slowly bending, engaging the core, inhale, palms together, exhale, moving out the right elbow to the, on the left leg, looking to the left, try to keep the elbows in one line, inhale, and exhale, you breathe in, and out, slowly coming back to the center, inhale, lifting up, exhale, and go. Well then, try to notice now how is the back feels, how is the lower back, how is the upper back, your spine. The, all the twisting poses is really good to let go of the tension. And let's move and try the balancing pose, the eagle pose today, okay? Uh, we start on the right side and remember, walk um, Balancing poses is all the time uh, needs focus. Focus to your breathing and focus to one point in front of you. Okay, we're bending the right leg first of all. You can place the palms on the hips and try to feel the opening the chest, keeping the back straight. Okay, start focusing one point in front of you. Okay, lifting the left leg up and then going all around. Here you will feel the tips moving to side right to bring it to the center and stay there. Breathe, inhale and exhale. Focus, focus to the breath, focus to one point in front of you. When you find you're stable or you can keep your toes on the mat to support yourself, it's okay. The arms and palm. And then the crossing and the left coming up, bending, going all around, keeping the palms together. Same, keep in the center the arms and stay there. Inhale and exhale. Feel your back here. Inhale deeply. Exhale and you can sit a little bit more down. Inhale and exhale. You breathe in, lifting up, and then letting go the arms and your legs. Move a little bit of the legs, let go the tension. Move into the left side. Start the same, bringing all your attention to one point in front of you and feel how you breathe. It really helps to focus more. Okay, coming fully now on the left foot, bending the leg. Inhale and lifting the right, going all around. Try to bring back your hips. If you, um, you don't want, maybe just a little bit. Okay, focus on inhale and exhale. Breathe in and up, and the arms in front, and crossing the right, coming up, bending, going all around. Inhale and exhale. We breathe in and up. Okay, one more deep inhalation. You can go a little bit more down. If not, stay where you are. Inhale, lifting up, letting go the arms and your legs. More. Let go the tension from the legs. Try to notice how is the balance in your body, which side was better. If her uh, balance was not so good, it's okay, don't worry. It depends on the energy, it depends how you feel, from emotion, some days we are more balanced, some days we are less, and it's okay. Also, the practice helps to improve your balancing. But let's uh, focus more to the back today. Let's do a little bit more bending forward, okay, staying a little bit apart. Place the palms and the hips are more into the half bending forward and then the full. Open the chest, looking forward, inhale. Exhale, and we start slowly bending and going down halfway. And you stop there. When you feel 
it's 90 degrees, okay? If it's difficult, you can bend the legs. Just stay there for a few breaths. Try to feel the spine straight, looking down, inhale, and exhale. Okay, one more deep inhalation. And now when the exhale starts slowly bending more down on the hips, let go the arms if you can touch in the mat. If not, where you are, and just stay and breathe there. Okay, if you need, bend the legs, it will help go more down. Inhaling and exhaling. Try to feel your bending from the hips, keeping the back straight, not round. Inhaling and exhale. You breathe in and out. When you're moving in this pose, try to be aware how you feel, how is your back. It's not just about Going more now, it's more important to keep the spine straight. Okay, inhaling and exhaling slowly, then going down, and from here, moving down on the mat. Going down on the mat comfortably, that your back feels good, your legs. And then bending the right leg, hugging your knee, trying to bring over your chest as much as you can. And also try to remember your back full and the mat seems with your shoulders it's lifting up. Then roll it back. Inhale and lifting the toes up, trying to put your knee to the head. Exhale and slowly going down. Inhale, lifting up. Exhale and bring down. One more time. Inhale and exhale. Now placing the palms to your inner thigh. And with inhalation, lifting the leg up and exhale and bring down. Inhale and lifting up. Exhale and bring down. We breathe in, lifting up, and stay there. Feel the stretch in the leg. If it's too much, bend a little bit to the leg. Inhale and exhale. One more deep inhalation. Exhale, letting go the right leg. Bending the left one, hugging your knee. Bring your shoulders back on the mat. Trying to bring your knee towards the chest as much as you can. Notice how's your back feeling. Inhale and lift through the posture of trying to push the knee with the head. Exhale and go down. Inhale, lifting up. And exhale and go down. One more time. Inhale. And exhale. Placing the palms to your inner thigh and with inhalation, lifting the left leg up. Exhale and going down. Inhale, lifting up. Exhale and going down. One more time. Inhale and deep, lifting the leg up and staying there. Breathe. Inhale and exhale. We breathe in and out, slowly letting go. We let go the left leg. And now we will be working also with the core and your back. Place the palms fully on the mat and we'll be lifting both your legs up. We inhale, lifting up, exhale, and down. Inhale. And one more time. Inhale, lifting up and stay there for a few breaths. Inhale and exhale. One more deep inhalation. Exhale and going down. If you find it difficult and have the wall near you, and it's also good practice when you have back pain, just come in nearby the wall. Lifting the legs up and bring down. Try to keep yourself also the 90 degrees. 
and you will feel how nice and your back feels in this pose. It's lifting all the tension from the back, also it's good for the blood circulation. And just stay there for a few breaths, breathing and relaxing. Okay. Let's do a little bit more twisting for the spine, keeping both your legs bended. And your arms, then same level with the shoulders. Okay. Inhale and lifting the legs up. And then when we exhale, we slowly start more first the left side. You can place it on the left palm and try to push. Keep the arms same level with the shoulders. And start feeling the twist. If you can, go all the way. If no, just try to remember not letting now the right shoulder to lift up, trying to keep it on the mat. And the arm in front. Okay, I don't have enough space, but you can keep it. Inhaling and exhale. If you don't need pushing, keep the arm on the floor. Inhale and exhale. Breathing deeply, notice how is your back feeling in this pose. And exhale. Breathe in, lifting the legs up, coming back. Now we'll be moving to the other side. Breathe the arm in front. You can place the right thumb now. Inhaling in the center, exhale, moving your legs to the right side. Looking now to the left. And try to feel how is your spine doing. Inhale and exhale. You can move more. I don't have enough space for my home studio to move more. I could do it probably lay down different position. Inhale and slowly come back to the center. Okay, from here on we'll to a happy baby pose. The legs still bended, lifting up, taking your big toes and lifting down. It's good relaxation pose, just moving the sides, relaxing your back, relaxing the mind also, remembering what it means to be child. Moving the weight feels good for your back. Letting go of the tension from the back. And then slowly we're letting go of your legs. And we prepare yourself for Shavasana for the relaxation part. Feeling comfortable here. Lay down and check all the parts of the body. Just check your head, your back, your legs, your arms, keeping the arms a little bit apart, arms a little bit apart, palms facing up, your eyes closed, and bringing all your awareness now just to your breathing. Feel how you inhale and exhale. Keep breathing through the nose, deeply and slowly. And allowing your body now to relax. Every breath brings more relaxation into the body. You inhale relaxation into the body and exhale and you're releasing the tension from the body. The pain is leaving, stress, 
thoughts, all the worries. Inhale and relaxation. Exhale, we letting go. Letting go. Just simply give permission for your body to relax now. After the practice, your body deserves the relaxation. If your mind still keep wanders, just keep repeating in your mind. I'm inhaling and relaxing. I am exhaling and letting go. And to relax deeper your body, bringing your focus now to your forehead. Feel your forehead, breathe through your forehead and relax your forehead. Relax all your face, your temples, your nose, your eyes, your cheeks, lips, your chin, jaw, your tongue, all your face muscles. Feel the face is getting more and more relaxed. The tension is leaving from your face. It's just relaxation. Relaxing all your head starting from the top and slowly moving down start relaxing your neck relaxing your shoulders to stay there a little bit longer and breathe and bring relaxation to your shoulders let go the tension from the shoulders Relaxing all your right arm. Relaxing all your left arm. Relaxing all your fingers one by one. Relaxing your chest. Relaxing your belly. Relaxing your back, your upper back, your lower back. Feel the relaxation moving through the spine. Relaxing your hips. Relaxing the right leg. Relaxing your left leg. Relaxing your feet, relaxing your toes. All your body is relaxed now. Feel how the relaxing energy is running through the body, pulling all the parts even getting deeper and deeper into the body. Relaxing even your bones, your joints, muscles, your organs, even your cells. All the body is fully relaxed now. Just stay in the relaxation and enjoy the present moment. You are here and now.
And then slowly bring back your attention to the body. Feel your body swing down on the mat. Start feeling your fingers and your toes and then slowly them moving. Feeling your head and your neck rolling from side to side. Feeling the arms and legs stretching all the body. And then slowly moving and laying down on the left side. Staying there for a few more breaths. Keep your eyes closed. Just breathe. Inhale and slowly coming back to the sitting position. Find yourself a comfortable place to sit, keeping your back straight. Eyes closed, palms on your knees, facing up. And have a deep inhalation. And then slowly exhale. Breathe in and out. Use your breathing now to connect deeper to your own body and notice how is your body feeling after the practice. Do you feel any difference from the beginning of the class? Maybe there is less tension or maybe more tension. Just be the observer of your own body. Then bring your awareness to your mind. Just watch what's happening in your mind. Notice your mind. Maybe now it's more calm and more clear. Or maybe no. Just observe. And use your breath to connect your body, mind and soul to one, to union, to connect deeper to your inner you. Feel with every breath, you're becoming more and more closer to yourself, to the real you. Allowing yourself to be who you are. Feel your own energy. Feel this energy more fresh, more new, changing. Feel the new day coming. The new energy is fulfilling you. Fulfill yourself also with motivation. Inspire yourself. everything in the world changing the same in you your energy changing your body changing your mind just allow yourself to be in this time of the change to step into the new to with your open heart to stay in the new energy fulfill yourself with this new energy the way you want the positive vibe with the good with the light and love and with inhalation place the palms together to namaste from the heart center slightly bending the neck and saying thank you to ourselves for today's practice saying thank you for stepping on the mat Working with yourself, growing with him. Then simply inspiring yourself with this new beginning, with the 
new journey for the new day. And let yourself know, I love you, you're beautiful, give yourself a big, big smile, inside and outside. And if your eyes could close, rub your palms together to the past, feeling the heat and active energy now. And then placing the palms under your eyes. Feel your own energy now through the practice. Try to notice if there's any difference, how you feel. Maybe you see colors or images. And then spreading your all over you, placing the palms on your head, your neck, your shoulders, your arms, chest, legs, your legs, and through your toes. All over. And slowly open your eyes. Namaste. Thank you. Thank you for joining this practice. I hope your back feels much better. Not so much pain and tension anymore. And you feel more connected to your body. Connected more to your mind and yourself. Feeling ready for a new day. With refreshed energy. More active energy. And calmness in the mind, of course. Relaxing thoughts, positive thoughts. Wishing you all a nice day and Namaste. Mm -hmm.